What's up, people? It's your boy Jatwa. I'm here today in Kerbal Space Program. I'm here to show you my tiniest aero cycle that I have built in a long time. I think this one wins the cake for being the smallest Duna capable aero cycle that I've worked on. It has a double bladed rotor system in here that allows it to actually lift in, on Duna. So you're not just stuck roving around at, you know, 10 meters per second. I've gotten this one up to 45, no problem. So that being said, it has some amazing stability because that one SAS is more than enough to get it to where it needs to go. Fly over, check out some rocks, because rocks are cool, right? Rocks are awesome. <laughs> this is actually designed, it's really cheap. So it's designed just to be like a throwaway. You just toss it to the side and go back to curbing when you're done. Of course, the rocket that I built wasn't really meant to land. I was going to originally launch this thing from uh, orbit and just have the Kerbal fly in and have fun on the way in. But I decided, what the heck, I can land. And so it doesn't really have enough fuel to go back. Um, luckily, I have more crafts that are actually in orbit around Duna. So I can just refuel it pretty easily. But still, oops. <laughs> uh, so yeah, here's here's your little rover deployed. So we'll go ahead and play it in reverse. And you'll see it can swing out and it has this little extending arm. And it does a little rotation so it can swing the craft in. It's, it's really nice. I really like it. It took me not very long to do that, to be completely honest. <laughs> we are so not gaining power here. like that could be gain there we go now we're gaining some power <laughs> it all. if i wanted to i could fly over it all but i really just wanted to hover so we're just gonna hover just above the ground move this down to one to 1.8 and now we can take a look aerial at these rock formations and uh see how interesting they look <laughs> All right, so if you like what you're seeing, hit that like button, drop me in the comment, let me know what you think. And if you like this craft, I can definitely put this out on uh, Kerbal X. Um, the whole rocket's not that impressive. I am not that great at rockets. But if you want to see this little aero cycle and you want to play around with it, uh, it should work on any planet with an atmosphere. So definitely, especially with it working here on Duna, in this really thin atmosphere, it shouldn't be a problem. So I'll catch you guys in the next one for now. It's your boy Jatois, and I am out of here. We're going to land. We're going to analyze this rock for science and the lulls. <laughs> in fact, we're going to land right on it. We can find a good spot to land right here. I think right here is good. Right there. Perfect. And there you go. Landed on our nice, interesting looking, looks like Jurassic Park um, excrement. But hey, that's just a theory. A Duna theory. I'm out of, I'm out of here. Peace. <laughs>